The period of Lent is seen as a time of observance and preparation for the celebration of the death and resurrection of Jesus at Easter. The reason that I, I observe it is to help me understand more of the sacrifice that Christ made, enter into that experience a bit more. And then uh, the purpose again is that when Easter comes, there's more of a celebration of the new life and the resurrection that, that comes along with that. The 40 days represents the time Jesus spent in the wilderness, enduring the temptation of Satan and preparing to begin his ministry. When I think of 40 days, immediately I think of Jesus being led into the wilderness for 40 days. Uh, right after his baptism, the Spirit led him out into the wilderness. That's where he was tempted. Uh, he endured those temptations. He fasted. He prayed uh, during that time as well. The number 40 appears 146 times in the Bible. So there's something significant about 40, and I don't know the like biblical numerology or things like that specifically. But what I notice that comes out of those times is always this, this rebirth. So 40 days, uh, Jesus was in the wilderness, and then he kind of launched his ministry. It was sort of launched as baptism, but really in terms of interacting with people and, and announcing the good news of the kingdom that started after those 40 days. For Pamela, Lent is a deeper relationship with Christ. I think a big thing that I learn in the practice of Lent really comes just from relationship with Christ. She says Lent eliminates distractions in those 40 days, which allows her to live out the lessons learned for the rest of the year. There might have been things that he's been speaking to me about already that in the 40 days I become more cognizant of because I'm not as distracted. And then the trickle down effect throughout the year is that that lesson that needed to take root in me takes root over those 40 days and then I tend to live that out. Lent affords an opportunity to reinforce the significance of Christ's work. For Bridge City News, I'm Loris Alexander.